Today we will be having mixed vegetable that's cooking. Hello my beautiful people, good morning to you wherever you are. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. I am going to be making an emergency or uh, vegetable because one of my friends is asking me to do this for her. I'm having some mixed vegetable and we will be doing it just like half boiled and we're going to be frying it after sorting all the vegetables together. We're going to be having ladyfinger, cucumber, cauliflower, onion and carrot. So we're going to be talking about the benefits of this very vegetable. Cucumbers are low in calories, but it's high in nutrients, high in many important vitamins and minerals. It contains antioxidants. It promotes hydration. It makes aid in weight loss. It may lower blood sugar. It could promote regular regularities. such as detoxifies your body, keeps your brain healthy, release constipation, lower the risk of cancer. It also keeps your body cool and hydrated, like I said before, and also keeps your kidneys healthy. Taking cucumber also freshens the breath for some people who have had a long day and maybe have not talked for a very long time. Some people like taking gum or you can try just by taking cucumber. Just chewing the cucumber or taking the cucumber juice for as a natural remedy is very good for the body. And intestinal wounds. As you can see, I have already sliced the cucumber. First of all, I removed the peelings and this is the inner part of the cucumber which I separated to make it very easy for me because I'm going to be cooking them in phases. First, I'm going to be starting with the ones that I know that will hardly get the salt. Now I am chopping up the carrot. Carrots are loaded with vitamin A and beta carotene, which there is evidence to suggest can lower your diabetes risk. They can strengthen your bones and many other issues. Carrot has calcium and vitamin K, both of which are important to the bone's health. It also uh, protects your skin from sun rays. The beta carotene in carrot is a skin-friendly nutrient that gets converted in vitamin A inside the body. It helps repair skin tissues while also protecting skin from harmful radiations like the sunburn or sun rays. All the best food for healthy glowing skin you can find is carrot. In addition to their sweet flavor and satisfying crunch, Carrots are picked with better carotene, vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. You can also get a gorgeous hair by consuming carrots. Carrot provides your hair with, vitam with vital vitamins, making your looks stronger, thicker, and shiner than ever before. These are all these are all fruits and vegetables I have tried and my friends and families have tried and we all see that they are doing good on us. I'm hoping that in a, one of these days you're also going to try this and see how good it is on your skin, your hair and your bowels. Consuming the liquid juice from carrot is better off than chewing than eating the fiber because it's very fast and acts quicker since it gets through your body faster. Onion contains antioxidants and compounds that fight inflammation, all of which may lower heart diseases and risk. Their compounds, anti-inflammatory properties may also help reduce high blood pressure and protect against blood clots. Eat raw onion every day if you want to beat the summer blues. We've all heard of this. After all our years, our moms, our nannies and our daddies have ensured onion find its place in our whole some plates of salad, juice or food. As for me, I'm not cooking, 
without onion. Ladyfinger contains fairly good amount of fiber, which have a soluble fiber in the form of gum and pectins, which helps to lower serum cholesterol. Ladyfinger contains iron, folate, vitamin K, vitamin C. It helps to improve the iron and folate acid contains of the body in a natural manner. I usually like to chop off all my ingredients and prepare them for the next step. Cauliflower is a vegetable that is naturally high in fiber and vitamin B. It provides antioxidants and that can protect against cancer and also contains fiber to enhance weight loss and digestion. It may also help to strengthen bones, boost the cardiovascular system and prevent cancer. Tasty way of eating cauliflower, cauliflower is like making it with a pizza or making it with mixed vegetable like I am about to do today. So, consuming fruits and vegetables of all kinds has been found to reduce the chance of developing many adverse health conditions. Eating more plant food such as cauliflower has been found to decrease the risk of obesity, diabetes, heart diseases, and overall. Some people might say cauliflower is not good, it doesn't taste nice, but the secret to cooking cauliflower is what you're watching right now. At the end of this cooking, this recipe, you will see how yummy it will look like and maybe from today you will start consuming or eating cauliflower vegetable. Stay tuned right on and see how we're gonna be doing this recipe together for I bet you it's gonna be looking so yummy and so inviting. After chopping and putting garlic has some real health benefits such as protection against the common cold and the ability to help lower blood pressure and cholesterol level. A few collection of garlic cloves mix and gives your food the magic flavor that can remedy it and start inviting people coming all around the corner. Garlic is a plant in the onion family that's grown for its distinctive taste and health benefits. Though it has very few calories, it is highly nutritive. Garlic contains magnesium, vitamin B, C, vitamin 6, C, fiber. In summary, garlic contains antioxidants that support the body's protective mechanisms against oxidative damage. Garlic is one of those spices or vegetables that you should always have in your kitchen, in your room, in your living hall, or in front of your home. Wow, wow, wow. I like when I chop my vegetables one after the other and line them up to start using the first to the last first year. As you can see, we have our carrot, cucumber, cauliflower, onion, garlic together. Now we're gonna be putting them in a pot to make the magic of the vegetable mixed. Pull around right with me and see how we're gonna have this recipe. Be together. First of all, I'm gonna be putting in the oil. Before doing that, I first of all want to explain about the carrots and the cauliflower. I am going ahead to parboil the carrots and the cauliflower separately because they are going to take a little bit longer to get cooked or fried. So I'm going to be parboiling them. Sorry, you're not going to see the video how I did it, but in further ahead, I'm going to explain 
how I went ahead to do that. So as you can see now, I'm using cooking oil. I'm gonna put it now for a bit. When it gets warm, then I'll be starting with the magic of the onion. The onion is going, the oil is going to last for a few minutes and then I'm gonna put in the onion to start the awakening of the magic aroma. I can't just cook without onion and or garlic. So leave them to simmer so the spices and the smell should come out. Then I'll start putting in the vegetable one after the other. I do not want the onion to be too cooked. I just want to get the aroma of the onion and garlic. Then I will put in the first step of the vegetable. That's why I keep stirring and stirring so that it shouldn't get too cooked or burned, even though it's on a low heat. Please do not forget to always put it on the low heat because we don't want our vegetables overcooked. can now put in the first bit of the vegetable we're gonna be starting with the lady finger I'm frying the lady finger because I want to I want it less slimy and green at the end when you fry lady finger it's not going to have that so much slimy when you mix it with the vegetable since you're not going to make a soup out of it so right now I'm going to be putting up some spices I'm using some black pepper I'm just going to put a little bit in it I like the flavor and the taste it gives to the vegetable So I'm going to put a little bit of it You can see how quantity I'm putting You can put as much as you want Just try to see put limited I'm gonna give it a stir and later on I'm gonna be adding in some paprika pepper. Mm, I'm getting the mixed um, aroma of the garlic, the onion, and the black pepper. It smells so great. Now I'm putting in the cucumber. As you can see, the lady finger is still green and it's not slimy, that's why I was frying it first. So I'm putting, I'm putting in the cucumber now, I'm going to stir it a bit and when it's half cooked then I will add on the other vegetable. Thanks for watching, I'm so happy that you tuned on with me right up to this moment. You would not regret it, trust me, because the end is always going to be something very positive for positive people like you and me. I just enjoy the scenery of the green. As you can see right now, I'm using some soy sauce. I like this, I like using soy sauce when I'm cooking because I got like the taste and flavor. Paprika is all round spices. I love the color, I love the taste. It makes the food so nice, looking so colorful. So I'm gonna be using some paprika powder right now. As you can see, I'm putting it in the board. I use it in my egg, my sauce, my vegetable, and even sometimes in my tea, I like to use paprika. Wow, I just can't see, forget about the color of the greenery of this vegetable, the flavor, and everything about it is getting better. This is positive vibration for positive people like you and me. So I'll just keep stirring and stirring because I'm not putting in any water. I'm waiting that the, the water will come from the vegetable itself. So I cover it now for a few minutes. Then I open it. You can see the magic. It's getting watery gradually, bit by bit. I'm not going to put in any water in this vegetable because we got some hydration coming out of there. Vegetable. I'm making it so natural and good. I 
can't wait to see how far it's gonna be so now I'll be putting on the inner part of the cucumber which I know is gonna be one of the last thing to put because it will not take so much time to cook keep staring keep staring diamond everything is going just the way you want soon we will get out some juice from the cucumber I've just put it in now just watch and see I need more greenish in color so I'm adding in the paprika powder and some flavor I'm gonna add in some soy sauce I like the taste of it and the flavor so I'm using paprika, black pepper, soy sauce, garlic, and cooking oil. That's just all I'm using. And the vegetable itself, oh my god. Just wait and see the last residue of this mixed vegetable. Mmm, I smell something great. Woof, woof, woof. Who let the dogs out? Woof. Woo, woo, woo. Can you see the juice of the vegetable? I didn't put in any water and I still have to put in the cauliflower and the carrot. Everything is getting mixed and cooked and getting so tasteful. Oh, I love the color. The redness of the paprika, the greenery of the vegetable and when I put in the cauliflower and the carrot, oh, there goes their cauliflower. So as you can see, I already parboiled this cauliflower and I also parboiled the carrot. I just had to mix them a little bit with some salt and I put them in the microwave and steam them a little bit for some time. So now you can see the color of the, uh, of the carrot. It's already half cooked, so I'm just gonna put them for, for a short time. I'm gonna stir them and stir it and stir. Mind you that there is no water in this vegetable, it's just the natural juice from the vegetable. So I'm not gonna be adding any water. Everything is natural. I love natural things. So oh, it's yummy. I still have some broth. Yeah, I'm gonna cover it over and later, later on I'm gonna put in mixing and mixing and mixing. It's getting ready. It's getting ready. I'm so excited. I wish you were here with me, but I bet you to do this at home. I bet you to do this at home. It's so yummy. Everything is ready and I'm gonna serve it for myself, my friend, and we're gonna eat it together. You're welcome if you want to join us. Thank you so much, my beautiful people, for staying on with me right up to this time. You're so awesome, you're so beautiful, I'm so appreciating you right now because you're right this moment and you're seeing what I'm doing. Oh, the juice from this vegetable is so sweet, so lovely. After mixing everything together, I can't wait. I'm taking the second scoop. So you can eat this with rice, you can eat this with some bread, you can eat this with some paratha. You can eat this with some noodles, anything you want to eat with it. You can fry some potatoes or you can fry some green plantains or ripe plantains. Next time I'm going to make some ripe, some yellow plantains, we call it tape. And I'm going to make another dish like this. So my friends, my lovely beautiful people, you can comment down below if you like my video. Please don't forget to like and share. You can click the button down there so that next time when I get a video new you will get my notification thank you so much for going with me now we are just gonna enjoy this beautiful dish together I wish you guys were here with me so you can get the juice out of this vegetable keep living healthy keep loving your life keep being the star thanks for watching diamonds creations it's been so lovely having you all the way I love the greenery, the color of this vegetable. It's so good, it's so awesome. I'm sorry I couldn't wait to do the testing session because my friend is rushing off from work so she'll be taking it to work with her. So thank you so much. I love you guys. You're just the best. You're just the best. and share.
share my video. If you enjoyed my video, please share so someone can enjoy. Thanks for watching Diamond's Creation. God bless you. God bless us. Bye-bye. See you.